right, and we're starting a little bit early today. And uh, I need a tennis ball today. Okay, we're gonna do some things with the tennis ball. And we're gonna do some passing today. Uh, work on our passing. And um, some other things as well. So hopefully you enjoyed today's workout. And let's get started. Okay, we're just going to do some basic crossovers. Loosen up the back a little bit. Nice and wide. Looking around. Keeping your head on the swivel. Going at medium speed right now. Stand it up nice and tall. Okay, behind the back. Through the legs. Make sure we're rocking back and forth with our body. Looking both ways. You got to convince that defender that you're going that way, 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 going that way. Okay, other side. You got to be proficient. Going in both directions. Going that way, going that way, going that way, going that way. Look at my eye. Sometimes you gotta stare. Sometimes your eyebrows gotta be up. Good. Okay, this time we're gonna do one of each. Crossover through the legs behind. Crossover through the legs behind. Now notice I'm hesitating after that series. So I'm gonna sort of pause and let the ball just sort of come up. Crossover through the legs behind. 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 Notice I stand up. Crossover through the legs behind. 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 All right, great job. Nicole. What's up, Dom? Wendell. Okay, this time we're going to do two of each. We're going to do a double cross. Back and forth through each leg and behind the back. So we're just loosening up right now. Okay, we're doing medium speed dribbles. We're just yo-yoing that ball a little bit. Okay, we're not going machine gun. We're not going too fast just yet. Okay, so we're going to go cross, cross. Back and forth, back and forth, behind, behind. Cross, cross, back and forth, back and forth, behind, behind. Cross, cross, back and forth, back and forth, behind, behind. Cross, cross, back and forth, back and forth, behind, behind. Cross, cross, back and forth, back and forth, behind, behind. Cross, cross, back and forth, Back and forth, behind, behind. Okay, great job. Very nice. So we're going medium speed dribbles right now. Okay, working on ball handling. Okay, this time we're going to work three of each. Three of each. Starting to pick up the pace a little bit. Okay, stretch those hamstrings out. Those feet wide. Make sure you're breathing normally. Bend the knees a little bit. Point the toes to the outside. Stretch those inner thighs. We don't want to do this initially. We want to make sure that we're out here a little bit first for about five minutes. Do some dynamic stretching. Okay, you can grab uh, one of your legs with your opposite hand. So I'm going to grab my right leg with my left hand. And then you can grab your left leg with your right hand. Good. Keep breathing normally. 
right leg back, keep that heel flat on the ground, toes facing forward, switch it up. And we'll do some dynamic stretches with the arms with some ball handling in a minute. Okay, so now we're going to do three of each. Okay, one, two, three. 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 Now I want you to incorporate a hesitation when you're doing this. So that you get in the habit of looking and hesitating when you're, when you're handling the ball against pressure. Okay, so we're gonna go one, two, three, pause, 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 one, two, three, pick it up, one, two, three, pause, one, two, three, pause, one, two, three, pause. Now notice I stand up when I'm pausing, okay? You have to change speed and change directions. Okay, so let's try that again. Okay, one, two, three. Now look in each direction that you're dribbling too, because that's really important. Okay, to really sell it to that defender. Okay, all right, here we go. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three, pause. Scissors. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three, good. One, two, three, pause. 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 One more. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three, pause. One, two, three. All right. Good work. Yeah. Come on. Very nice. Okay, now we're going to do some uh, power speed dribbling. Continue to get loose. Okay, doing a great job. Okay, keep it up, Don. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna go one, two, cross. So we're gonna do speed dribble and then crossover. One, two, cross. 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 Now notice I'm going from straight leg on one side to straight leg on the other. So that I'm nice and relaxed and believable. You gotta be believable. You can't just. You're not believable. You gotta be believable. Okay, here we go. One, two, cross. 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 Good. Now have consequences. If you make a mistake, do a push-up for every mistake. Okay, now we're gonna do triples. We're gonna go three and one across. But we're gonna go through our legs. Okay? So mixing it up a little bit. Okay, here we go. Three and one. One, two, three, boom, 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 one, two, three, boom. Great job. Okay, now we're going to shoulder height with four and then drop it behind. Okay, here we go. There's a hesitation in there. Nice and relaxed. One, two, three, four, five. 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 Now notice, I'm stomping my feet when I go behind my back. I'm not wrapping it. I'm slapping it. Okay, a couple more. One, two, three, four, five. Slap your feet. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Very nice. Excellent job.
Okay, now we're going to bring the tennis ball out. Okay, need a tennis ball for this next part. Okay, we got to work on lots of distractions, simulating game stress. So it's important that we do different things during our workouts. Okay, so we're just going to start with regular alternating dribble with both balls. Okay, get used to it. Okay, it feels real weird. Look around. Use your peripherals. Be nice and relaxed. Don't get too stressed out. Keep that ball alive. Switch. Good. Good. Which side felt more comfortable? Relax your legs. Good. Very nice. Okay, let's go again. This time we're going to go simultaneous. Now one ball is a little lighter. Save it. Okay, nice and relaxed when you're saving it. Good. Very nice. Excellent. Come a little higher. Good. Keep it alive. Good. And switch. Move your feet out of the way. Good. I haven't done tennis ball in a while, so a little bit tricky. Okay. Nice and relaxed. Good. Very nice. Okay, now we're going to do a cross cross. The key to catching this ball is to look at the ball, the tennis ball, not the basketball. Okay, so keep that in mind. Okay, now we're going to, before we go back to the tennis ball, we're going to do some basic cone drills. So we're just going to go back and forth. Okay. We're going to go crossovers twice, through the legs twice, and then behind the back twice. So up and back, we'll do crossovers up and back, through the legs, and then up and back, behind the back. Okay. Now today, when we do our crossovers, I want to work on sort of a KJ uh, preparation move. So when you cross over, I want you to step opposite. Okay, does that make sense? So I'm crossing over and stepping opposite of the ball. Okay, let's do that again with the crossovers. Cross and step opposite. Cross and step opposite. Cross and step opposite. Okay, cross and step opposite. Cross and step opposite. Cross and step opposite. So you're working on change of speed and direction and deception. Okay? All right, here we go. So now we're going to go through our legs and step opposite. So through the legs and step opposite. Through the legs and step opposite. Through the legs and step opposite. Okay, again. Through the legs, step opposite. Through the legs, step opposite. Through the legs and step opposite. Okay, again. Through the legs, step opposite. 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 This time we're going to go behind the back and step opposite. Okay, behind the back, step opposite. Behind the back, step opposite. Behind the back, step opposite. Okay? This is a great move depending on where the defender is. Okay, behind the back, step and look opposite. Behind the back, step and look opposite. Behind the back, step and look opposite. And notice I'm shuffling my feet in there. Okay, now I'm going to go consecutive. I'm going to go up and back, crossovers, up and back through the legs, and up and back behind the back, stepping opposite. Okay, we're working our way up to the Kevin Johnson move that we'll do later today. Okay, here we go. Make sure you're looking in that opposite direction also. Very important. Okay. Oh, step opposite. Step opposite. Step opposite. Step opposite. Step opposite. Step opposite. Through the legs. Step opposite. Step opposite. Step opposite. Step 
opposite. Step opposite. Behind the back. Step opposite. 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 Great job. Very nice. Stepping and looking opposite. And okay, now we're going to come back to the tennis ball. Okay, this time we're going to do a cross cross, toss the ball in the air, let the ball bounce, and catch it with the same hand. Okay? So we're dribbling, watch the ball, cross cross, and catch. Now, if you let the ball bounce twice, that's fine in the beginning. Okay? So nice and relaxed. Now you gotta watch the tennis ball, otherwise it's not gonna work. Okay? Just you're on autopilot with the basketball. You already know you gotta do a double cross. Catch. And notice how I'm stepping forward with my foot. Okay, if this, this drill is good enough for Steph Curry, it's good enough for all of us. Okay, here we go. Nice and relaxed in the shoulders. Good athletic stance. Okay, toss, cross, cross, catch. Keep the dribble alive. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross. Now, when you're practicing this, really work on a nice, straight tennis toss. So don't just, with a quick wrist, just fling it. Make sure you have good tempo. Release the ball roughly at your chin, so that way, it's landing in the same spot that you released it. Okay? All right, here we go. We're going to do 10 more. Nice, easy dribble. One. Look, look. Good. Look, look. Good. Look, look. Good. See, I'm stepping with that foot to go get it. Okay, work on your footwork. Cross, cross. Good. Cross, cross. Good. Toss, cross, cross. Good. Toss that ball at your chin. Cross, cross. Good. Now watch this ball. Cross, cross. Watch the tennis ball the whole time. Cross, cross. Good. Cross, cross. Good. Cross, cross. Good. Ooh, ah. I had to really reach for that last one. Okay. All right. Let's switch hands. Okay. Now, first couple times on the other side, you want to get that right away because the brain's confused right now because it was used to the other side. Okay, here we go. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Keep that dribble alive. Toss, cross. Oh, I lost the ball. See, that's what happens if you're not aware of your spatials. Okay, make sure you have consequences if you lose that ball. Okay, here we go. Toss, cross, cross, and catch. Okay, here we go. Toss, cross, cross, and catch. Watch this ball the whole time. Toss, cross, watch my eyes. Cross, cross, catch. I'm not even thinking about the crossover. Good. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross. Oh, go get that ball. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Two more. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Toss, cross, cross, catch. Last one, toss, cross, cross. Oh, and that was a second bounce. See how quickly that ball bounces. Okay? All right, doing a great job so far. Okay, now this time, we're going to go back to the original hand. Okay? In a minute, we're going to keep working on some ball handling. Okay, we'll come back to that so we don't put too much pressure on our backs. Okay, now with these cones, if you have a cone or even a rock, or this tennis ball on a flat surface, we're gonna work on hand speed, okay? Anybody can do these drills without a basket. Okay, I wanna make sure we're still recording here. Okay, for those of you watching nationwide, appreciate you tuning in. We've got some college players checking us out here on Hoots Elite Skills Training. Make sure you subscribe my YouTube channel give me a thumbs up if you like this video all right okay so now what we're gonna do is just a cross cross pick the cone up okay just like you're holding an ice cream cone or a, a cup of coffee that you're gonna drink and then you're gonna switch hands and cross
cross the ball over and work on your hand speed. Okay? So we're going to go cross, cross, looking, pick it up, switch, and slam it. Now notice my posture. I'm not hunched over when I'm grabbing that cone. I'm sitting in a nice athletic stance when I grab that cone. So I'm low to the ground and I'm working my explosiveness. Okay? All right, here we go. Pick up the speed a little bit. Cross, cross, pick it up, switch, slam. 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 Cross, cross, pick it up. Look at my side step. When I'm cross crossing, side step, pick it up, switch, slam. Cross, cross, pick it up, switch, slam. Cross, cross, pick it up, switch, slam. Cross, cross. Great job. You want to pick that cone up or that ball up cleanly. Okay. Doing a great job. All right. Good to see everybody. If you missed it so far, I'll be posting it up on YouTube a little bit later today. Okay. All right. Let's go back to the tennis ball. Doing a lot of ball handling today. Okay. Now this time, we're going to do a triple crossover, and then we're going to catch it with the opposite hand. So we're increasing the level of difficulty. So we're dribbling, and we're going to toss the ball in the air, release the ball right about at your chin, okay? And then you're going to cross over the ball three times as fast as you can, and after the ball bounces, you're going to catch the ball with the opposite hand. All right, does that make sense? So let's try that. Now, if the ball bounces twice, that's okay. Okay, then just work your way towards one bounce, and then eventually you're going to be catching the ball in the air without the ball bouncing. Okay? All right, here we go. Watch the ball the whole time. That's the key. Okay, I went and got it. Okay, you want to try and toss the ball near you, okay, but that was a good first try. Now the ball's in the other hand, obviously. Okay? So you're alternating in this drill. Okay? Watch this ball the whole time. One, two, three. Okay, that was a second bounce, so I'm not aware of my spatials very well that time. That ball hit the cone. So that's why I like props out here, so that you're always aware of your surroundings. Just like in a game, you can't step on the sideline. Okay, you gotta know your spatials between yourself and a defender. So when you're tossing this ball, I have some spatial uh, awareness out here. Okay? All right, let's start again. Okay, here we go around, watching out for that double team. Okay, we're going to watch this ball. One, two, three. Good. That was better. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Good. 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 Now, you can see we could go faster, probably. One, two, three. Oh, great stab. Go after that ball. Work on your explosiveness. One, two, three. See, I wasn't aware I hit the cone again. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. Good. See, I'm stepping with that foot. One, two, three. Good. Two more. One, two, three. Ah! Oh. Good. One, two, three. Good. One, two, three. Good. Great job. Love it. Okay. I'm going to go back to some other ball handling. Okay, great to see everybody. Okay, keep working on your game. Okay, now we're going to go back to our cone stuff. We haven't done any shooting yet. All ball handling so far. Okay, now we're going to work on our Steve Smith, which is one of the most important moves that you can learn. Steve Smith off of a quadruple or triple threat. Steve Smith in transition or Steve Smith in the half court. Okay, he was a great NBA player, Michigan State Spartan, came after Magic Johnson, and uh, has been an announcer for a number of years. And this move has been used more recently a lot by uh, Isaiah Thomas, the more uh, recent Isaiah Thomas, not the old Isaiah Thomas. Okay, and the trick to this is, is that you dribble fast, but you turn slowly. Okay, you can't do this. That's a carry. So when the brain has to do these kinds of things, one side is doing another, 
and the other hand is doing something different, it takes the brain time, and that's why repetition is so important in this. So we're going to dribble fast. Now notice the same foot that I'm dribbling with is going to come back as if I'm going to spin because what's a Steve Smith? It's a fake spin. So you've got to sell to the defender that you were trying to spin. Okay? So now I'm going to dribble fast and turn slow and dip my shoulder like I was going to spin. Okay? Now notice I'm looking that way too. Okay? Now notice my dribble's quicker, but my lean is more realistic, more believable, a little bit slower. Okay, we're going to do 10 of these. Okay, here we go. Make sure you take the ball with you a little bit, okay, so that you protect that ball so it's right in front of your chest. Okay, we'll go the other way now. I'm dribbling fast, but I'm turning slow. Okay, I'm not doing this. That's a carry. Dribble fast, turn slow. Dribble fast, turn slow. Dribble fast, turn slow. Dribble fast, turn slow. And then you would continue to matriculate towards the basket. Okay? All right, last one with the tennis ball. This time we're going to do a double cross and try and catch the ball in the air. Okay? Okay, here we go. Watch this ball the whole time. Cross, cross. Here we go. I'm trying to catch the ball in the air. Cross, cross. Okay, just missed it. Okay, get that ball. Don't short arm it. Okay, get it up about six to eight feet in the air. Okay, I had it in my hand, but I bobbled it. Because I wasn't relaxed enough. You gotta trust yourself. Okay, here we go. Good. 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 Excellent. Great job. Okay, switch sides. Okay, don't throw too high, but throw it low enough where you get a little bit of a challenge. Okay, here we go. Watch this ball the whole time. Don't watch the crossover ball, because then you'll lose sight of the ball you're trying to catch. Okay, the whole objective is, is to be on autopilot when you're dribbling and be focusing on other things so that the ball handling comes naturally to you. Okay, here we go. Okay, good first try. Okay, here we go, I gotta trust myself. Okay, can't use your body, that doesn't count. Okay, three bobbles. Okay, you gotta catch it cleanly, have soft hands. Good, one. Relax your face, relax your back. That's a carry, that doesn't count. Two, change the speeds of the dribbles. Three, four, five. Great job. Okay, take a little water break if you need it. Anybody got any questions? Okay, keep up the good work. Okay, so be ha ready to have that tennis ball with you. Okay, so that's it for the tennis ball today. Let's see what we got going on today. Handles. Here we go. Now we're going to come back to uh, picking up the cone, working on hand speed. If you feel a little bit tight anywhere, get a little stretch going out, you're warmed up. Okay, we're doing about 20 minutes of ball handling for those of you that just joined us. Okay, okay so now this time we're going to go back and forth, back and forth, pick up the cone, switch, and slam. Back and forth, pick up the cone, and switch. Now if you don't have a cone, you can grab a rock, okay? You can have a tennis ball, okay? It doesn't matter what you have. Water bottle, okay? You can have a water bottle out here. Most everybody's got a water bottle, okay? So it doesn't really matter what you have. 
Okay, an alternate to this drill is that you just put one thing over the other. Okay, so we're gonna go back and forth, pick it up. speed we're gonna go 10 on each side okay make sure you're nice and loose make sure your vision is good in each direction okay this is building your confidence to handle the ball when someone's pressuring you okay all right here we go back and forth pick it up switch 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 try and pick it up without looking back and forth pick it up switch back and forth pick it up Back and forth, pick it up, and switch, 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 two more back and forth, pick it up, and switch, back and forth, pick it up, and switch. Okay, great job. Keep looking around. Okay, now we're going to go back to the cones. Okay, and this time we're going to do one of each. Okay, one crossover, one through the legs, and one behind the back at each cone. And we're going to do that for 30 seconds. Okay, I should be able to go up and back in 10 seconds. So I should be able to go up and back three times. Okay, so we're working on one crossover, one through the legs, one behind the back at each cone. Okay, here we go. Great job. Try and get in that zone a little bit. Okay, if you need another drink, you can grab it real quick. Okay, we haven't done any Jordans yet. We've had a lot of fun today so far. You don't even need a basket to do this first 30 minutes of stuff, okay? Okay, so we're going to do 40 Jordans, 40 Jordans. So Jordans, again, are just one, two, and so on and so forth. So going consecutively, okay? All right, here we go. I'm trying to get 40. Ready? Go. Looking in each direction. Three, four, five, six, seven. Now the next thing we're going to work on is our 1-2-1 one, one series, okay, because you really got to learn how to change speed. So that was a speed dribble, okay, so we'll continue to work on some speed dribbling, but then we're going to work on our 1-2-1 one, one series, okay, here we go, we're going to go 10 seconds, below the knees, ready, go. Great job. You should get at least 40 when you're going real low machine gun. Great job. Okay, let's go around the neck. You can do this in the beginning too if you want. Nice and quick. Get it all the way around the head, change directions couple times, okay, around the waist, feel that ball, doing all kinds of things to be more tactile, okay, figure eight, get nice and low, look at my stance, I'm not hunching over, 
I'm sitting down with good posture. Excellent job. Okay, let's go in the other direction. Good stance, good posture. Three, two, one. Great job. So we're working on conditioning while we're training, getting in shape, basketball shape. Haven't run one sprint yet. Okay, now we're gonna do the one, two, one series. Okay, and for those that have been with me for a while, know this, so you can just start doing it. Okay, but the one, two, one series, if you ever done ladder work, on some explosiveness now. Okay, now, even if you don't have a ladder, you can mark your driveway up with some chalk or some tape, or just use your imagination, okay? Slide these cones over to the other side. Okay, now, we're going to incorporate some agility, but the one, two, one is one foot in, one foot in, one foot out. One foot in, one foot in, one foot out. One foot in, one foot in, one foot out. Right, left, right. Right, left, right, left. Right, left, right. Left, right, left. Right, left, right. Left, right, and so on and so forth. Okay, so two feet go in and one foot goes out. Okay? One, two, one, 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 one, two, one. Now when you're doing agility, you want to go quickly. One, two, one, 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 one, two. Okay, great job. Okay, a couple more. One, two, one. Excellent job. Keep it up. Very nice. Okay, so now we're going to dribble. Okay, we're going to dribble while we do the one, two, one. Okay, so we're going to start with the right hand on the way up, left hand on the way back. One, two, one, one, two. Left hand on the way back. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two. Get your half a little bit. One, two, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Great job. Okay, now we'll speed it up a little bit. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, one, two, one. So now you're not even thinking about the ball handling, similar to the ball toss, now you're just dribbling on autopilot. Okay, here we go. One, two, one. One, two, one. Okay, one more time up and back. Great job. Okay, now we're going to do that without the ladder, and then we're going to start to incorporate some shots. So I'm going to slide this over a little bit. Okay, so now we're going to do the one, two, ones with just the ball as if you're a point guard or you're handling the ball for a minute going up against an aggressive defender. Okay, so we're going to go side to side and you want to stay in the middle. If you don't stay in the middle as a point guard, then you can't initiate the offense to both sides. Typically, you're going to go to your dominant hand side and your dominant eye, and that's going to become problematic because
because you're going to always be looking to go only to one side of the floor and you got to be able to see both sides of the floor. Okay, so let's go 10 seconds of one, two, one crossovers. One, two, one, look right. One, two, one, look left. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Same footwork as the ladder. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Call the plays out. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, 41. One, two, one, one, two, one, 41. Bryce, Triton, one, two, one. Great job. Now you can do the same thing through the legs. Okay? So you go one, two, one, 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 one, two, one. Now you also want to go forwards and backwards. Okay, because if you're if someone's guarding you, okay, so if this is my defender, and he's starting to come up on me, one, two, one, sometimes I gotta get away. One, two, one, one, two, one and create space. Sometimes I wanna take that space back because the shot clock's running down and I need to go to the rack and attack directly at that defender. So depending on the situation, that's gonna dictate whether or not you're creating space between you and the defender or reclaiming it, okay? All right, through the legs. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, two, one, one, two, one, two, one, one, two, one. Through the legs, if you make a mistake, Improvise, cross over, go behind your back. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Side to side, side to side, side to side, side to side, side to side. Okay, great job. Okay, now we're gonna go behind the backs. One, two, one. Because you can't always cross over, go through your legs, the defender's gonna steal it. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, one, two, one. Ah, oh. One, two, one. Look inside to side. Eyebrows up. Eyebrows down. Eyebrows up. Eyebrows down. Look at the wing. Look at the corner. Look at the post. Look at the post. Look at the wing. Look at the wing. Look at the corner. Look at the corner. Look at the post. Look at the post. Look at the wing. Look at the wing. Look at the corner. Look at the corner. Oh. Okay, so that's an empowering drill to really make you feel good about your handles. If you lose it, just jump right back on and, and start dribbling again. Okay, so now this time we're gonna go back and forth through the same leg. Okay, we've had so much fun today. We haven't taken one shot, not one. People always wanna go out and shoot. We'll shoot later. Work on your handles. Work on your game management. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, back and forth through the same leg. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, ah, oh, hey, corner, corner, wing, wing, post, post, Nod your head, nod your head. Wing, wing, post, corner, corner. And say it out loud. Say where you're looking. So that gets you in the habit of speaking. You can't be quiet on the court. One, two, one, other leg. Wing, wing, 41, here we go. 41, post, I got you, I see you. 41, back and forth, right, left, boom. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. forward. Backward, forward and back. One, two, one, side to side, side to side, side to side. Okay, great job. Okay, now this time we're gonna incorporate all of it, okay? After the in and out. So sometimes you think you're gonna cross over and then all of a sudden the defender steps up and you can't do a crossover, one, two, one. You gotta do a in and out, one, two, one, okay? And you see the best point guards in the world, male and female, yo-yoing the ball like this. It's like Angela Harris at Kansas State University, okay, to Chris Paul, to Kyrie, okay, it doesn't matter what point guard, Diana, okay, Sue Bird, it doesn't really matter. Okay, they all know how to handle the ball and change speeds, change directions, be believable with their eyes and their body language. Command the respect of your team and the opponents Scout and report. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one. Wing, wing, post, post, corner, corner. Going back, going back, going back, going back. Side to side, side to side. Entering the ball that way, entering the ball that way. Boom, boom. Oh, in and out, in and out. Cross, in and out, in and out. Slow, 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 slow. One, two, one, one, two, one. One, two, one, one, two, one, two, one, one, two, one. Ah! Oh! Oh! Wing! Wing! Corner! Corner! 
Close, close, accelerate, stop. So you gotta be able to accelerate as soon as that defender comes up on you. That's the moment you go, and then you gotta be able to work on your braking system and stop on a dime. Okay, let's make sure we're still going here. Okay, great job so far. So you got any questions? Okay, here we go. What's up, Howard? Just Marsley in the house. Okay, so now we're gonna work on the same thing, except we're gonna accelerate, okay, whenever you want, and then stop on a dime and work on that behind the back slam and go right back into your one, two, one series. Okay, here we go. One, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, one, wing, wing, corner, corner, post, post, wing, wing, corner, oh, accelerate, stop. One two one, one two one, one two one, one two, one two one, one two, one two, wing, wing, stop. One two, one two, one two, one two, one two, one two, two more, one two, accelerate, stop. One two, one two, one two one, one two, wing, wing, accelerate, stop. Okay, great job. Rain or shine, we're out here. Keep up the good work. Okay, so that's a lot of ball handling today. Okay, now we're gonna work on acceleration. Okay, so we're gonna go, we're gonna use the cones and the ladder to go right and left and work on our different combo moves. Okay, so we're only going to do one of each right now. If you want to do more than one, that's fine too. Okay, so we're going to do, first thing is we're going to do one crossover at the first cone, through the legs at the second, and then behind the back at the third, and then accelerate into a rondo. So remember, rondo is you're coming in for the layup, show the ball to the rim, turn back to the outside, fake the shot, fake the lean in, rip through, or up and under, and lay it in, okay? So we're gonna do one of those on each side. Okay, here we go. And then once we're done with that last cone, accelerate, okay? All right, here we go. Cross over, two left, behind the back. Rondo, boom. Ah, look somewhere else before you shoot. Okay, if you miss a shot like that, come right back. Okay, make sure you're looking somewhere else before you shoot. side we're going to go do our one two one okay and then after the one two one we're going to go uh rondo on the other side okay so left hand dribble one two one one two one one So we're going to do Steve Smith at each one, okay, and then a behind the back move, okay, so that we counter at each at each uh, cone. And then we're going to go in for a regular windmill Barkley on the layup, avoiding the defender reaching, okay. All right, here we go. Steve Smith behind. Steve Smith behind. Steve Smith behind. We're gonna go one, two, one again on this side. One, two, one, one, two, one. Okay, great job. Okay, now this time we're gonna work on the KJ crossovers. So we're going to crossover step opposite. Crossover, step opposite, crossover, step opposite, and then we're going to go in for a spin move. Okay? All right, here we go. Crossover, step opposite, crossover, step opposite, crossover, step opposite, spin. Good. 
we're going to continue to work on our one, two, one. hand on the other side. This time we're going to go through our legs and step opposite. Okay? Through the legs and step opposite. Through the legs and step opposite. Through the legs and step opposite. Okay, now this time we're going to do a side Barkley hop. Okay? All right, here we go. And through the legs, side. Through the legs, side. Side Barkley hop. Be careful if you're here in Southern California. It's a little bit wet out here now, but we're going to keep going. Okay, we're going to full work a little bit more. Okay, great job. Okay, this time we're going to go behind our back and step opposite. Okay, behind our back and step opposite. with the euro because it's a little bit wet out. Okay, just go nice and slow on your euro, which sometimes is even better. Okay? All right, here we go. Behind the back and step opposite. Behind the back and step opposite. Behind the back and step opposite. Great job. Okay, ready to go behind the back. Working on change of direction. Going behind the back and stepping opposite. So keep working on that footwork. started that one a little bit early. right here. Okay. And they're about, you can see this, they're about a foot away from me. Okay, when the defender's a foot away from you, you can work on your little side jabs or your rips. So we're going to work on a side jab. And notice I keep the ball opposite of my side jab. Okay, so I'm up high first, because I like to bring the ball up high first, try and get that defender to relax. Okay, and then I look opposite of where I'm going to go. Okay, so I sidestep, cross over, and go. And we're going to work on our floater now. Okay, when you're working on your floater, take your layup footwork and just start at the foul line when you take your layup footwork. See, the sun's out already. Okay, here we go. Okay, start high, look around. Good, sidestep. One, two. Start off slowly. Okay, nice and high. Okay, side step. Now notice the ball stays outside here. If I bring the ball across, the defender might rip it out of my hands. Okay, so keep the ball on that hip. Side step, cross. Okay, I'm trying to go a little bit slower right now because it's slippery. Okay, but you want to slow down once you're doing the floater part. Okay, boom, boom. Get it up nice and high so you don't get that shot blocked. Okay, there you go. Side jab. Find the groove. Okay, when you're shooting the ball, try and find the grooves as you're taking your your two steps. Don't shoot knuckleballs if you can help it. Boom.
Okay, here we go. Side jab. Okay, one more try here. You're getting some good work in. Side jab. There we go. Okay, great job. Make sure your middle finger touches that ball last when you're shooting. Okay, now we're going to go the other way. Good. Side jab. Okay, hold that follow through. Notice how I pulled the string on that shot. Okay, make sure you hold your follow through. Okay, rain or shine, we're out here. Okay, keep that ball on that outside hip. Don't sweep it across. Side jab and cross. Ball stays on the hip. like that one, so I'm going to go back and do another one. I like to swish my shots. Make sure that your elbow finishes even with your ear. Okay? There it is. Okay, now. Now we're going to do the LeBron. See if anybody's got any questions. That rain's slowing down now. Okay, great job, everybody. What's up, Kurt? Let's go, Dom. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, now, if the defender is two steps away from you, then it's a little bit trickier because they're daring you to shoot. And if they're daring you to shoot, they're not respecting your jump shot, obviously. Okay? So... We're going to work on the LeBron, and the LeBron is you step through with one foot, look like you're passing, bring that same foot halfway back as if you're pointing that foot directly in the middle of the defender's feet, and still look like you're going to pass with a little flick pass, look over there still, and then you're going to slowly go through your legs, pivot on your heel, and then go the other way. You know, this time we're going to work on a jump shot. Okay, we're going to work on our braking system. Stop on a dime, and then shoot the jump shot, okay? So we're going to step through, pass fake, drop down, look around, boom. Okay, you really got to work on your braking system when it's raining out, otherwise you're going to fall. Okay, so same thing in a game. If you, ain't, if you don't have a good braking system with your feet, you're going to fall, or you're going to lose the ball. You got to work on stopping on a dime. Call me crazy. Boom, one more. Good, look around. Look around. Drop down slowly. Good posture. Don't hunch over. Oh. Stop. Pick the ball up. Nice. Now, some coaches may not want you to do this move. Okay, I love this move. It just keeps the defender on their toes and gives you one more option, one more tool in your toolbox. Okay, next time we're going this way. Good, we're looking. Good, we're looking. Okay, switch feet. Good, we're looking. Halfway. Slow, slow, accelerate. Boom. Great job. Stepping through. Pass fake. Stand up tall. Looking over here. Looking over here. Well, boom. Ah, stop on John. Find the grooves. Find the grooves on that shot. As you're hopping, go from a knuckleball to finding those grooves. You got plenty of time. Okay, here we go. Step through. Pass fake. Boom, lean. Boom, go. like that one, so I'm going to do one more. Step through, slow, boom. Okay, great job. Okay, now, the defender, hold on one second. Okay, we're still live on Facebook.
All right, we're back live here. Okay, so now all of this is based on where the defender is. Okay, so again, if the defender is all up on you now, when you step through, see how the defender's right next to me? And they're not letting me turn. Okay, now you gotta have an option here because doing this is not a good option because then you miss teammates that are open. You gotta be able to see people and you may not be able to rip through at this point because the defender is not letting you. And if you do rip through, you've lost vision. Okay, so you gotta be able to look over your shoulder like Magic Johnson used to, be nice and tall and have a Steve Smith in the bag. So before we worked on the, state, the Steve Smith off the dribble, okay, the Steve Smith off the dribble, okay, now this is gonna be the stationary Steve Smith. Now you gotta be careful because you don't wanna travel, okay? So after you step through, defender's right up on you, okay, and there's still a path on that side where I step through. The defender's not all the way over, okay? Only the defender's arm, windshield wiper, is in my way. So I'm gonna look back the other way, like I'm gonna spin, but I'm gonna fake spin. And I haven't used my dribble yet, okay? I'm gonna fake spin and go. Step through, fake spin and go. Now it's gotta be quick or the ref's gonna call a travel. Boom, step through, look over there, protect the ball, fake spin and go. Okay, now we're gonna do that same thing, okay, except we're gonna go in for a jump shot again. Okay, just a straight ahead jump shot this time. Okay, step through, Steve Smith. Make sure you follow through. Make sure your elbow finishes at your ear. Relax the shoulders. Make sure that ball is picked up at your waist because you always wanna dip the ball before you shoot. You never wanna shoot like this. You're slower and shorter. We want to stand up nice and tall when we shoot like Steph Curry. Very little flexion in the knees. Make sure your feet are left if you're a righty. Make sure your feet are right if you're a lefty. Okay, before you shoot. You got to have a slight turn right or left before you shoot that ball. And make sure that your middle finger touches the ball last and elbow even with your ear when you finish that shot. Okay, here we go. Step through. Good. Steep through. Now make sure that you're looking somewhere else before you shoot. Look somewhere else before you shoot. You can't get fixated on the rim, okay? Muscle memory will take over. Okay, other side, step through. Good, Steve Smith. Okay, just a real subtle fake spin to freeze that defender. Boom. Great job. Okay, now when you step through, the defender is being real aggressive and they're all in your way. So now the only option is to spin and seal them and go back the other way. Okay, does that make sense? So now if I try to do a Steve Smith, they're in my way right here. Okay, if I try and do a Steve Smith, they're in my way. So the only option is to spin. And how do you properly execute a spin? After you step through, and then they're taking away that shoulder. They're, let, they're not letting me turn back. I can't turn back. And I can't do this, because then I can't play the game. Someone else got to take my spot. You got to have an option when a defender is crowding you, and they're in your way, and you can't go in the same direction that you turned. So now you have to hook the ball 180 degrees, okay? and throw a bounce pass to yourself. So in slow motion, it'll look like this. Okay, does that make sense? So we're here, we rip through. Good, now if we're going the other way, it's the same thing. We step through. Defender's in my way. I can't do a Steve Smith and go because they're in my way. Otherwise, I'll be dribbling to the sideline. Now, you can do this in the half court or the full court. It doesn't matter. Okay, so we're stepping through aggressively. Okay, and then we 
bring the ball 180, bounce pass to the other hand, and then go. Okay, so we step through. And go. Okay, so both sides, boom. Okay, hand, it's not a travel. You're hooking that defender. And if nothing else, they'll get off you for a second, and then you can slam the ball. Right? And then they go flying. Get your respect. Okay? Changing speeds and changing your dribble. Okay? Yeah, you like that, huh, Danny? That's what I'm talking about. Okay, keep it going, Dom. Okay, so we're going to spin and go into our jump shot. Step two. You gotta have all these tools in your toolbox. On, call that the Jordan series. Okay, that's working on our footwork. Watch out for that ball, don't lose it. Okay, doing a lot of different things. Okay, now we're going to do some shooting. If you have any other requests, let me know. We went through a lot of stuff today. Okay, we're going to get some shots up. Okay, we're just going to go elbow to elbow. But, but, but today, before you shoot, okay, spin the ball to yourself. And you're gonna pass fake or shot fake, okay, and a little jab, a little half jab before you shoot, okay? Okay, we're gonna shoot 10 shots. Okay, here we go. Jabbing with both feet. Great job. Okay, I made nine out of ten. I'm very upset that I missed that ninth one. Got to make those money balls down the stretch. Come on. Okay, this time we're going to go uh, elbow to wing. Okay, a little shot fake. Make sure you're believable with your shot fake. You don't have to come way up here on your shot fake. Just, just a little chin action. Just a little shoulder action. Just a little... Just a little fainting move okay all right elbow 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 to wing both sides okay here we go hold your follow through Here we 
go. You're jabbing with both feet. Four or six, Dom. Great job. So that was 17 out of 20 on that last series. 17 out of 20. Okay, so that's 9 out of 10, 17 out of 20. So I don't know what that is. 26 out of 30. Okay, so that's 75% or 65%. Is that 65%? Yeah. No, that's got to be better than 65%. Let's see, 23. 7, 9, and 10. 16, 20, uh, 26. 26 out of 30. So that's 13 out of 15. What am I talking about? 13 out of 15. Okay, so that's pretty good. I don't know what that is. Six and a half. I don't know. We're good. <laughs> okay, now we're going to do a baseline. Okay, baseline to baseline. Okay, so about 12 footers on the baseline. All right, here we go. 10 shots. Okay, so that's 34. Okay, great job. 34 out of 40. Okay, 34 out of 40. Okay. Great job, Dom. Okay, keep up the good work. Okay, now we're going to go off the dribble. Now we want to work on some of these moves that we just worked on to get by the defender. Okay. So at each spot, we're going to work on a different move and then finish up for today. Okay. So the first one is we're going to work on the KJ into a Steve Smith for the elbow to elbow jump shots. Okay? All right, here we go. KJ. 
Confident, hold your follow through. Get a good angle. Finish with your elbow, even with your ear. Step opposite. Smith. Make sure you look somewhere else before you shoot. Side step, opposite. Stay focused. Keep your head on the swivel. And again, your goal is to also try and swish these shots. Don't just be satisfied with making them. Okay, set your goals high. That's six for six so far. Finish with your elbow at your ear every time, and you find the grooves on the ball every time, you're going to be consistent with your shots. Okay, here we go. Okay, two more. We're setting the goal high here. Nine for nine. Okay, money ball right here. We got to hit the clutch shot for the win. And I walk the dog. And I walk the dog. Ball coming back to me. Let's go. Okay, 10 out of 10 off the dribble. Let's go. In the rain. Yeah, come on. That's what I'm talking about, Dom. Okay, Facebook is gone because my phone died. Okay, now this time we're going to work on... Uh, we're going to do uh, one of each okay, and then go into that uh, same shot. Actually, I changed that. Let's work on a through the legs wrap, through the legs wrap, and then a hesitation, and then a continuation. Okay? Through the legs wrap, stop quickly, stand up, and then a continuation. Okay? Here we go. Deadly with these mid range jump shots. Swishing a lot of shots today. Fourteen in a row. Here we go. in a row, Dom. Let's go. Just working on a little hesitation here. Nineteen for nineteen, Dom. Twenty for twenty. Okay, here we go.
Come on, Dom. That's 30 for 30. Yeah, come on. Yeah, we got that on film. 30 for 30. Let's go. Come on. Okay, last shot, Dom. talking about oh come on 40 for 40 there you go dom great job today whoa let's go in the rain Finish with two free throws. Yeah, come on. Let's go. Fifty-one years old out here doing it. Let's go. What y'all got? Got that on film, Dom. Let's go. That's a great job today. You gotta find your motivation. Whether it's raining, snowing, whether there's a pandemic, it don't matter. Set your goals, try and achieve your goals, 40 for 40 on that last round. That's what I'm talking about. Until next time, get out there and as Coach Bobby says, can't get your butt in the gym right now, but you can get your butt in the driveway. All right, until next time. Great job, everyone. Make sure you subscribe to my elite skills basketball training, Mike Hootner, and peace out. Much love to everybody. Be safe.